Rinwell, mind if we chat a little? Mm hmm. I'm surprised to see you up reading so late. What have you got there? Oh, it's a book about magic. I was hoping I'd reach the end of this chapter before I went to bed. I'm impressed you can read all that tiny text without drifting off. It's easy. Honestly, the subject is so interesting, it keeps me wide awake. Although I have to admit, the more I read this book, the more I realize just how much I still have to learn. I hate not knowing it all, so it pushes me to keep learning as much as I can so I can be a real expert. So that's why you're studying by the campfire every night, huh? You've really changed, Rinwell. R really I don't feel like it. Remember how you used to be when we first met in Calaglia? Sure, but that's because I was still hiding a lot from you guys. Am I really all that different aside from that? Definitely. It's the difference between a rock and the sun. Are you saying I used to be like a rock? That's not something you should use to describe a girl, Alfin. <laughs> My bad. But the comparison is still apt. You used to not be open with us about your magic at all. And now look at you. Well, I guess you may have a point. I used to hate studying magic because my parents made me do it. And after everything that happened, I... I felt like it brought nothing but trouble. But now, I don't think it's so bad after all. Maybe I really have changed more than I thought. All magic is simply astral energy combined with knowledge. It's neither good nor bad by itself. It all depends on how you use it. Saying it out loud, I guess I finally made peace with it. I think you have Law to thank for that. What? W why him? I mean, he was kind of the one who... Nope, he's got nothing to do with it. None. Zilch. Nada. Nothing. <laughs> if Law heard that, he'd be pretty bummed, you know. Y you're crazy. I don't see why he would be. Are you saying you'd rather he wouldn't be? <sighs> I'd say the fact you can get so worked up about things now is another sign you've changed. Sounds like someone wants me to put on a little magic show. <laughs> all right, all right. I'll take my leave before I say anything else that might get me into trouble. Just make sure you aren't staying up too late, okay? Ugh, I'm not a little kid anymore. Yeesh. Though, actually, it felt kind of nice hearing that. I wonder why. Ooh.